your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Gabriella Pagan with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines for May 31st. Protesters are continuing to call for justice in the death of George Floyd and many others killed by police. People began gathering at the plaza at around 2 o'clock this afternoon. Today marks the sixth day of protests since Floyd's death on May 25th. Earlier today, Kansas City Mayor Quinton Lucas told protesters he's open to their message so long as it is peaceful. A difference isn't breaking up a place. A difference isn't making a property owner, including a black property owner, have to clean up the next day. A difference is saying that we're going to change the way we do things in a community. And the way we do that is by making sure our message is heard and amplified. And the way that message is heard and amplified is making sure we hear it. Now, 85 arrests were made after peaceful protests began unruly last night. Multiple protesters were injured as well as police. We know that two officers were hospitalized last night. Kansas City Police tweeted that one was injured in the head and another is now suffering from a lacerated liver after being hit by something thrown by protesters. Multiple businesses were also damaged during last night's events, along with trash littering the streets. Friends and family were helping the owner of a previously known store known as Restoration Emporium out on the plaza to pick up the pieces of the store and prevent further damage. Elsewhere, dozens of people collecting trash before protests resumed this afternoon. Your forecast is next. I'm meteorologist Gerard Jabaley. Get ready for warmer temperatures next week. Tomorrow we actually will see temperatures reaching the 80s. No problem. And we'll see our rain chances stay pretty small until around Wednesday. 86 by Wednesday. And uh, we'll see a few showers and thunderstorms possible.